find the alignment marks for that uh, on another page. I'm going to remove this um, assembly here. Now we have access to the uh, tiny marks of this cam here. I'm going to move uh, a few more parts again at the alignment because I can't see them with these arms in the way. So I've took out one, two screws already, three screws. I've just got to take out this fourth one. Gear out. Let's see what we can see. Any of that time of marks? There's only one hole, screw hold in this uh, loading arm supply side, so I've taken that out. We're nearly down to the deck. This here is lined up. There's a hole in the, the in the chassis. And this is to the left. The hole in this here lines up the chassis here and there's a little notch in that which lines up with a notch on the cap that there here so that's them all okay that's okay the problem must lie with this side here because I can't see much line marks and it's very hard for me to tell what I line so I'm going to have to investigate further see if I get some information on that end of it Okay, what I see is this arm here has got to be brought over here, so this hole lines up with a hole there in the actual chassis, you can see through. And then we got the same here, we got for the dealer lever, there's a little notch, little hole in the chassis there. And this goes into that. I have this lever and gear assembly in and I have that hole lined up with the uh, hole in the chassis and of course this one here is still lined up. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to put this other gear, um, this cam gear in place. This cam gear has a hole in it as well that lines up with a notch on the chassis. The notch is right there. I'm going to just put it in place now. Making sure that uh, I don't misalign any of the other gears in the process.
it was very hard to see with my arms in the way. This is still lined up with this hole here, and this is still lined up with this hole here. And I've just double checked with these, these are all still lined up around here. I'm going to get this mechanism back in as well. And there's a little, little notch on it there, an arm that goes into this sliding system here. First of all, I better not forget to put this screw back in. Hold this gear in place. Let's see, I never did one of these before, and I'm reading from an instruction book as I go on. I got this cam, uh, camming position now, and I got this lever here, and the little arm notching it goes into this groove in the cam. It's actually here, right at this spot here. Let's see, can I get a better shot at it? That's where it's sitting in there. And it actually lines with the screw. There's a hole in the center of it there, and it lines with the screw um, in the cam. I'm going to put this belt back in place. Yeah, it look here. I've tried various different methods to get this deck to work. Uh, the alignment hasn't been off. The problem has been, and when I looked at it under uh, a magnifying glass, is this rotary gear. I knew the problem was on this side. But I don't know if the camera is going to be able to pick this up or not. Let's see. Try again. It's not going to be able to pick it up. Right at that point there, in the this little groove, it's actually after wearing a hole through to the other side of it, and it's actually jamming on that. If you see there, you can see there it just sticks on it. If I slide that through around there and I slide it nice and easy, look, then it just comes to that point there, and it kind of you can hear it there. But there's a little hole there, you can see it right through. The dark spot. Right at that particular point. There. And that's where it's catching. So I'm going to have to order this part. 